Some of some of my customers. Hot some chicken of them might resent it. <laughs> Now, there's one lady. Her name is Erica. She comes here. She has ulcers. But she said the hotter it is, the better it is for her ulcers. Wow. She comes straight out of the hospital. That's amazing. And comes straight down here, got the hospital bed on. But she has to have it extra hot for her ulcers. Can you imagine? This young man comes here quite a bit. He comes about two or three times a week. He loves the juicy. He likes that hot juicy. And you would be amazed at what he said he did with the juice. He treats it as an aphrodisiac. You know what I mean? He loves the juice all over it. And he always wraps it up. And takes it out of here. <laughs> Seen it all. He's single. Beware. <laughs> Party. Bachelor parties come down here. And one time, the bride, the night before the wedding, the bride ended up rolling all over the floor. I hope she made it to the wedding. <laughs> After eating the hot chicken. I hope she made it to the wedding. She just went, rolled all over. It acts as an aphrodisiac, evidently, because sometimes there be very few people in here, mm -hmm. but the cars, the cars are rocking. Oh. You know what I mean? After hot chicken. The later it gets, the wilder it gets. I might have to come back here. Everybody's not from nine to five. There are some night people, late night people. Any other questions? That's it. <laughs> You've given me more information than I ever hoped to know about hot chicken. Hot chicken confessions. <laughs> Thank you so much. Hot chicken. <laughs>